city in Lincolnshire and uh, I'm outside this absolute magnificent beautiful cathedral it's my first time coming to Lincoln since I was a kid so today is a great opportunity to check out this city and uh, checking out what's going on here so let's check out Lincoln so before we go on the city walls I just wanted to show you the view of this absolutely beautiful cathedral from this side too this is at the other side of the cathedral and uh, you can keep walking on the cathedral you can have a look inside if you want to and if you want to take a tour around the city walls uh, there's an entrance fee so we're going to check the price of that in a minute and then uh, we're going to show you the view of the, of the cathedral and the views of uh, this city So that is the view of the arch down there, as you can see. And just to show you guys again the view of the cathedral, this is the view here. Absolutely stunning. So in Lincoln, this has to be one of the most steepest hills to get to the cathedral. And the further up you go, the steeper it gets. But all these streets are quite narrow, but there's quite a few um, places to eat and there's a few shops where you can buy stuff and there's a few coffee shops etc. But I want to show you this hill just to give you guys an idea of how steep it is. So if you guys are thinking coming to Lincoln, really nice place, quite hilly in places, but then you've got a flat section really enjoy myself but just um, if you book like cruises you've got to book well in advance as I've discovered and if you want to book the castle tour again you've got to book that in advance too because you just can't get a, a slot because of the of these times so this is the hill I was talking about so this walk up this hill will keep you fit as you can see, it's a bit of a slope. So once you reach the top, you've got a, like a, a pub on the left hand side there and uh, a few more shops and stuff. And there's a, a few like um, stalls at the farmer's market, just further up the top here. And uh, I can hear some like, um, Irish music in the background. Might as well show you that while I'm here for a couple of seconds. I thought I'd just show you a bit of that. Look quite interesting. And this is the path that leads up to the castle. If you want to buy some plants for your garden, they've got a stall here too, which is pretty good. And if you want to know the price listing of how much it is to go on this uh, wall here, I'll just give you a quick glance at the price here. 
So if you want to see the prices, pause the video, but that's the prices for that. And that's to go and check out the Lincoln Castle. So I think I'm going to try and book a time slot to get in online since I can't get on the coups. Uh, so patience is the key. So I managed to get a slot for going up this uh, place here for the walk around the, the castle. So once you pay, you've got to put your con the contact details in, which is quite a surprise because it's outdoors. But I know you just follow the rules as you do. So this is the stairs now leading up to the top. And look at the view here. Absolutely magnificent. So during these times guys, even though we don't like handing over our details, we just got to do it, haven't we? Bite the bullet. But no matter what, the virus is here to stay now. So now I'm at the top. And look at this view here. Absolutely amazing. If we're coming down here. That is the cathedral right there. Absolutely amazing view. And if I turn it around here, if I zoom a bit further, you can see the Lincolnshire countryside. Absolutely amazing. So that is the wall I'm going to be going around today, showing you around. And to enter this place, just to remind you guys, it's £10 and you can actually um, buy a ticket on the day so it's not too bad but if you want the tour you have to book in advance so i spotted a hotel for you guys who might be interested there's a hotel called the castle hotel so if you guys are thinking of coming to lincoln you're looking for somewhere to stay and that is a view i've got from the this castle wall around this uh, castle it's an absolutely incredible view you know, people are chilling out. You know, people are enjoying themselves. It's a beautiful day. And at this time of the year, this is the time to make the most of these uh, nice days. Because when winter comes, that's it. Let's show you another view of this place here. The view is absolutely amazing. It really is. You know. So, hope you guys enjoyed the walk along the castle here. And uh, just to pinpoint where you have to get your ticket from, it's right down that way. And it only costs £10. Fill out your track and trace form. You've got a hand sanitizer. And uh, you're good to go. Once you've done that, you go up the stairs like you saw and you just go for your walk and enjoy the view. So now we're going to get some food and uh, check a bit more of this city and uh, see what else happening in Lincoln. So today in Lincoln they've got like uh, a street food stalls and they've got a variation of different kinds of foods. As you can see it's a massive queue here. Well, I'm going to keep walking because uh, the music's blaring out loud. Well, as you can see, there's a lot of food stalls here. So they do like Mediterranean delights here. They do a lot of sweet stuff. Uh, they do like chocolate strawberry here. They do duck wraps here. All your drinks here. Ice cream. All your cookies and flat jacks and stuff there so it's really busy now in the city of uh, Lincoln and uh, they do crepes on this uh, stall here too which looks pretty awesome
some really nice food here. If you've got um, a sweet tooth, you can get your pick and mix sweets on that left hand side there too, which is pretty good. Some more snacks there too, and uh, they do like a chicken box meal there too. And later on, they must be doing hot dogs and burgers that they stole here. So that's uh, street food of Lincoln. I don't know how long, how long that is there for, but they do quite a variation of food, which is pretty good. So for some food today, I've gone from some uh, pork uh, sandwich here. And it comes out this here. Looks absolutely incredible. And uh, it'll cost me five pounds. And with that, I've got all these little goodies here, which is pretty awesome. Um, five pounds, and that's what you're getting. It was from a, a Polish food store just down here from where I'm sat now. So we're gonna just try and see if it tastes any good or not. But so let's see how good it tastes. Mm, really nice, guys. Honestly, absolutely incredible. Five pounds, and uh, that's what you get. And you get that as well. Really good. So, from what I can gather, the coos on this river is not open today. And I don't know if it's just because of these times. I'm not entirely sure. Um, so I'm by the the university why I'm here and uh, if you're looking for another place to stay there's a hotel called the Holiday Inn just across from here and there's quite a few restaurants over the bridge there too I want to tell you guys about an incident which happened a couple of days ago a couple of days ago I was on the bus wearing my face covering might have been on business and for these kids started giving me some abuse and I said to one of the kids you can't treat people like that so then I turned around and then one of them spat at me so I just got off the bus and that was it it's absolutely appalling that some kids behave like that towards people when you just fall in the nose by wearing your face covering at the end of the day, you're just wearing the face covering to protect other people. That's, that's the only reason why you wear it. But, so guys, just be careful when you are there. Any kind of incident like that can happen to you. You know? And the other day as well, Boris has mentioned that there could be a potential lockdown again. But me personally, I don't think it will happen because of the financial situation and uh, I just don't think it would help. The virus is here to stay now and I think if there's going to be restrictions it'll be a curfew from 10 o'clock till 5am and I think it will be no household mixing.
So I'm going to show you some restaurants and this is from the famous chef Michael Pei White. It's the Steakhouse Bar and Grill and you've got a few like uh, places to drink and there's a hotel, the Holiday Inn which I showed you earlier on and uh, that restaurant was uh, Gordon Ramsay's mentor for being a chef and that's how he became how he is today. So we're just going to go for a little stroll along here now and I'm going to show you a couple of bars, a couple of restaurants. You've got the Brazilian restaurant on the, this left hand side here and you've got a good view of the river there. It's really nice here. And there's quite a few restaurants along this place here. So you, if you came in on the night time, be really nice. You've got the burger place on this left hand side here, but it's not yet open at the moment. So a lot of people just come here to stretch it out really. You've got a Nando's on that side there too. So there's no shortage of restaurants around here, which is pretty good. I'm uh, just going to show you a few more restaurants up here too. But I've noticed most of your restaurants are on this river here. I didn't see too many in the city, but on the outskirts along this river here, you can see quite a few places to eat. So, you know, there's no shortage there at all. So, th this is your busy section here. You've got the Ask Italian restaurant on this left hand side here, too. You've got the famous Wagner on that side there, too. And that is uh, the busy bit there, so that's why I had to go around. But there's a few more bars and restaurants on this side here too. You've got the square and uh, further along here, you've got another pub too. So all your action for your eating and drinking is along this river here, if you come to Lincoln. And there you go, up ahead, stops here packed. And just to show you the view one more time, here is the view. Hi you guys, I've now come to this place called the Bar Unicorn uh, Bar Cafe Restaurant which is right next to Game if you wonder where it is. And I'm having one drink here, so cheers to everyone. Um, so I hope you find today's video useful, I've shown you around Lincoln. Nice place, you can stay for a couple of nights and enjoy it. And uh, if you want a map of Lincoln, just go up to the sign, just pay a pound. You can have a map of Lincoln and you've got to find a way around. So, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like this video, please give it a thumbs down. Please take care of yourself, the elderly, the sick, the young. And I shall see you guys in the next video. So until then, bye bye for now.